Mawa took on Glenrock at the Ice Vault in the Big North Green Division semifinal. Mawa was not taking them lightly, even though they beat them twice in the regular season. And with good reason. Both teams had chances in the first period with Mawa controlling most of the play. The second period was more of the same. The Thunderbirds continued to dominate. But Mawa defenseman Dan Carabin tried to keep the puck in the zone, but he lost his stick in the process. And Glenrock has a three-on-one. Kevin Doyle puts it away. You know, it's, it's a matter of making mistakes out here. In these type of games, you know, you make mistakes, you're going to pay the price, offensively or defensively. The rest of the second period, Mawa hammered the Glenrock goalie with shot after shot. I guess you could say we were getting frustrated that nothing was going in. Glenrock was called for a hold late in the period, and that began the turnaround. Chris Curtis took a shot from the point that Brandon Block deflected in. Second period ends one to one. Glenrock came out aggressively in the third period. Chris Curtis loses at least five yards on this play. But the aggression goes too far when Glenrock takes another penalty. Dan Carabin takes a slap shot that ricochets off the post and in. Uh, the kid shaded off of me on the backboards down there. I thought I had a lane, took a slap shot, put it on net, went off the right post and then went in. And that's how it ends. Mawa 2, Glenrock 1. What we need in a game like this, a dogfight game as I say, and uh, we came out of here with a 2-1 to -one win, a well-earned 2-1 to -one win, and uh, we either get another quality game on, uh, on Friday. From here on in, it's all quality opponents.